Hello. So let's go ahead uh, and talk about parametric sweep. What I mean by parametric sweep, consider for example the simple voltage divider circuit where I want to see the response when I am changing R2 in some step. So we perform such kind of analysis using dot DC. For example, uh, we were changing this voltage source using dot DC. Similarly, I can change some circuit parameter using dot DC. So how to perform this kind of analysis uh, will be shown in this tutorial. So let's go ahead and uh, let's uh, open the voltage divider circuit. Volt div and file save as volt div param. So I want to do a parametric sweep in this voltage divider circuit. So the parameter I want to sweep is R2. So first of all I will define a parameter and this is defined as follows dot param and you define some variable just like as you do in C language for example hash define C or hash define pi is equal to something and that value of pi will be placed everywhere the variable pi comes. So similarly, you can define a parameter in this case using this dot from statement. So let me define a variable list uh, dot from r where you can name anything this variable, but I am calling this uh, as r where and let me put the initial value as one. So there is a variable r where whose initial whose value is one. Now I can, if I want to replace this with uh, say uh, R where, so I will do it like this. So what uh, what is meant by this statement is this: R there is a register R two between node two and zero, and its value is what is defined in this R where variable that is one. So if you write one k here, so for example, so this R two will be a value of 1k. Whenever this R where variable come in this curly braces, uh, that will be replaced by the value of this uh, R where. Now, if you, you want to test whether it's working or not, so you can do that and you can see it working. Okay. So, this this uh, this uh, parameter, uh, this circuit file and the previous circuit file is same except that I have defined a parameter. Now, if you want to vary this parameter, you can do it as follows dot dc param param is a spice keyword so dot dc and name of the parameter so r where and i want to vary it from say uh, 1k to 5k in steps of 1k so r where will be initially set to 1k and then output will be evaluated then it will be increased by 1k this is step size then this means that r where will become 2k and we again the output will be evaluated and so on until this R where reaches to 5k. So let's uh, do this simulation and see what happens. So you see this R variable is varying from 1k to 5k. Now you can see how output is changing. Press Ctrl A and see this output B, B2. So this is how it is changing. Okay? So initially voltage was say, sorry this resistor was 1k so one when resistor is 1k so this is the linear curve I mean it is following this curve then at this point it is changed to 2k because the increment is 1k so again now the curve is something lesser because the output voltage is simply R2 divided by R1 plus R2 multiplied by Vn so slope will be lesser and even lesser and so on okay. And you can even specify this if you don't want to do it like this. You can specify using list command. So list 1k, 2k, 3k, and so on. So when you define it by list command, this means that R where will be uh, output will be evaluated for this 1k, 2k, and 3k. So this is how we can perform a parametric sweep analysis in LPS files. I will come to this parametric sweep again when I will do this for uh, CMOS inverter. Thanks.